And this just into our Live 5 newsroom. Two survivors of the 2015 mass shooting at Mother Emanuel, downtown Charleston, have filed a lawsuit. And it is against some very powerful social media companies alleging that those companies radicalized the shooter, Dylan Roof. Cameron Bob joining us now at the alert desk with details of that lawsuit. Cameron? Ruff and Dylan Roof killed nine people during a Bible study session on June 17th, 2015. Two people there that night pretended to be dead to avoid getting shot, according to this new lawsuit. Those two people are named as plaintiffs in the court documents filed April 5th. Felicia Sanders and her granddaughter, who's unnamed in the suit because she's a minor, allege that social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube radicalized Dylan Roof through the content the platforms showed him. Sanders was laying next to her son Tawanza as he died that night. The suit alleges even Google provided Roof the quote initial gateway to hate that YouTube and Facebook further cultivated through shared personal data that captured his information and his web history. The suit states quote weaponizing that information the social media defendants then use psychologically manipulative formulae to control what users see and steer them toward content that confirms their likes, dislikes, and biases. The suit also lists several Russian defendants claiming the Russian government was working to incite a race war in the U.S. So through selling advertisements to these Russian defendants, the suit states the social media companies, specifically Facebook's parent company Meta, should have known that those advertisements could potentially influence and radicalize susceptible users like Dylan Roof. At the alert desk, Cameron Bob, Live 5 News.